Race eight on the card is an MR74 handicap over 2,000 meters. The race to off at 15.55. We have a rerun. Origami's last run when beating Dream Destiny. That was on the 5th of April. And we have interviews with Dean Canamare and Gareth Finsale. Origami burst through. Tosh mentally angers towards the inside. Origami hit the front inside the 200. Tashman's running on. Run to Denmark. And Dream Destiny's come from nowhere. Karari's cowboy. Origami got away. Dream Destiny's running on. But Origami got the timing right. And Origami won it. Dream Destiny run to Denmark. Tashman's in a photo with great affair for the minor position. Joseph Jaggi, uh, last one very disappointing. Actually, took no interest. Uh, he was also gave him a break because I thought he was a bit flat. Put him on the farm, brought him back, gave him a nice run over fourteen hundred metres. Good run. His next run, uh, that was his second run back after rest. But nevertheless, it was a, just it was a shocking run. He took no interest. He was travelling fine in the early stages. Came in the start. He just, you know, he just never kicked on at all. Um, and came through he was 100 percent sound and he's a tough horse uh, you know he puts his best foot forward you can never leave him out but i was rather concerned about his last run but there were no uh, there was no reason for it they couldn't find any symptoms of bleeding or or you know unsoundness so put him in the bigger picture yeah coromandel's he's also quite a nice um, progressive type i think he might be a little bit better on the grass than the poly but he's well within himself and um, he's a horse that will win his races obviously as, as with the coupling in that race, um, drawn out wide on the poly, it's, it's always disadvantageous. Um, it's a, it's, you know, it leaves you with um, needing a bit of luck in running. Um, but yeah, he's, he's a nice type of a horse. Yeah, Secret, Secret is ours as well bred as you say. Um, not, a, not a big scopey horse, but um, he's, he's coming to his own. And you know, his last run was, was full of merit, um, but unlucky. So. Uh, again, that draw is hopeless. Um, he'll need a bit of luck in running. He needs to be given a chance, and you know, if, he, if he's too far out of his ground, then you know, there's only so much he can do. But um, you know, he, he'll be running on. And uh, if this was on the grass, and it, and if he had a a good draw, um, you know, none, none of those are near to the reality of the situation. But you know, if it was that kind of a situation, I would make him a, a real big runner. But um, now we we're just hoping for the best, really, with a horse that is progressive. Race 8, MR74, handicap 2,000 metres. We heard from Gareth Fonsell chatting about Coromandel and Secret is Ours. So he was uh, of the view that if this was on the turf and with a better draw, Secret is Ours could be a factor. Interesting, though, that Secret is Ours won his maiden on the poly track. The draw is a bit of a concern, but over 2,000 metres, Warren, uh, you should have a chance of finding some kind of a position depending on the pace in the early stages. Origami won his race on the turf last time. But his only run on the poly track is real. Did he runner up berth? I like this uh, three year old son of Water Winter. For me, I'm going to bank on him. I'm expecting him to follow up. I know it's a low grade handicap and things can go awry, but he's got a good draw. Dream Destiny, whom he beat, has come out to place in the feature race, the Highland Knight Cup. So the former stood, stood up well. It's either a field race or a banker race. And because I've gone wide in the early legs of the exotics, I have no option but to bank on number two origami. And that's my play. Well, I should have stayed home today because you could have done the show on your own. But uh, that is just a joke. Origami for me, uh, I was impressed with the way that he won. Jockey and horse combination, one from one. Sean Veal is going to be looking to make it two from two. He gave this horse a nice, powerful ride all the way home. And... He impressed me. I think he's going to be better than an 82 rated. He could be on the up and, uh, yeah, as you said, neatly drawn. I've also taken a stance. We spent a lot of money in the earlier part of the card and we have to narrow it down. We take our chances and uh, I'm like you in the camp of origami. Just one other horse I'd like to mention. Uh, yeah, well, you heard from Gareth, Coromandel, Secret is ours. The, those two horses, I think if they do get over from the draw, which as you mentioned, they can from the 2000, they've got the time, are certainly ones for exactors. But yeah, after all is said and done, origami for me and you. My more confident banker on the day is Silver Maria. So although I'm going to banker both Silver Maria and origami in the pick six, I'm going to take uh, a jackpot cover with number 12, Secret is ours, because... He does have the pedigree you heard from Gareth. He's not a big horse, uh, but his post-maiden run was exceptional. So 
Uh, Secret is ours is probably the one that uh, Origami is most to fear from, although Teichman and Karari's Cowboy are weighted to finish a little closer to him. But we're big on number two, Origami, to follow up on his last win.